So I want to show you how to play Dynamite Hack, Boys in the Hood, this little finger picking pattern that I love. I think it just appears in the verses, not in the chorus in this song, so that's all I'm going to touch here. Let me show you the right hand first, and then the left hand. The right hand is a pretty conventional finger picking pattern. Your thumb is, let's do it, we'll do it on an A chord and then a D chord first. So an A chord, your thumb is going to be hitting the open A string and then D string on the second fret. And in this song you'll have to do an A chord like this eventually with one finger across those three strings. So your thumb is hitting these two the whole time. And then you're going to have two fingers assigned to the G string and the B string. So your index finger gets the G only and your middle finger gets the B only. So you're going to go, let's build it up like this. So you're going, start with that, and then this. Next finger on the G. Then we're going to go all we've added is the middle finger on the B string but it sounds a lot more complex when you just add that one additional thing. So another way you can think of it is the first move is thumb only on the open A. The second move is a pair. It's thumb on the D string, index finger on the G string. So that's thumb only and then thumb index, and then it's thumb on A paired with the middle on the B string, and then back to thumb index, thumb on the D, index on the G. So you get thumb only, thumb index, thumb middle, thumb index. When you put all that together, that's the pattern for the entire the entire verse. When you do that on a D chord or any of these other chords that use the top four strings, you just move that entire right hand apparatus one string towards the floor so you get this. Now let's look at the left hand, all the chords. We're going to start with this open A chord and you're going to have to use finger one across the D, G, and B strings. Next move is your third finger has to reach out to the fourth fret of the A string. Well, you keep your first finger there, so that's frets four, two, two, two. Then we go to this. I'm sorry. Now we've moved the right hand to the top four strings. That's open D, second fret, third fret. Open, and you should use your middle two fingers for this, for uh, finger two and three, because you're about to do this. Bring your first finger in on the first fret of the D string. This one sucks, by the way. This will take some practice. Second finger stays where it was. It's on the second fret of the G, and then fourth finger is on the fourth fret of the B string. Then you move up to this got a bar at the second fret across all four strings and your pinky is hitting the fifth fret on the B string. And then we get this, middle finger comes in on the third fret of the D string and you still have that bar across the second fret with your first finger so that's three two two two. And then we get this move. So that's changing chords a little bit faster here, changing chords right in the middle of the pattern. So right now it's 4-2-2-2, two, 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 and you're going to go half of the pattern on this. And then you let go of that fourth finger and it just leaves the bar, your bar on the second fret, to do this second half of the pattern. So again that was... And then finishing it up with a plain old D chord. Have fun.